Good morning, homies. How's it going? It's a Wednesday morning. I'm going to BK to get some grub. Work's pretty slow today. Figured I'd just start vlogging. Fuck it. Um, yeah, so I'm obviously I'm fucking hungry, so I'm gonna get some BK. Head back to work. Hopefully, we don't have much going on around lunchtime. I'm trying to go eat with Kaylin, which you'll meet her later today. Um, I'm gonna probably go to the fair tonight. It's a dollar ride night at the fair in town. It's only here till like Sunday, I think. So I'll probably go there tonight, hang out a bit. Yeah. Woo! Finally off work. First time I've been off work this week at a decent time. So that's nice. It's actually not even as hot as it was yesterday. Yesterday it was in the low 90s, which isn't all that bad, but it's been raining here and it's normally never humid. So it was like really disgusting and it wound up putting me to sleep actually. I wound up going home, doing some editing for the video that's about to be live actually. And then uh, I fell asleep. I fell asleep on the recliner. I was gonna take like an hour nap, go, what was I gonna do? I was gonna do something anyway. I was, oh, I was gonna go food shopping. And then, uh, yeah, I woke, up, I woke up at like 7.30 at night and I was like, fuck. So I like, went to get up and I was like, all right, I'll just sleep like 10 more minutes. And I woke up at like nine. My day was ruined from there. I was up for like an hour after that and then went right back to sleep. So essentially I got like damn near 12 hours of sleep yesterday and I'm still tired. <sighs> but uh, I'm gonna go home. What am I gonna do? I need to look at my dog bone now to see which version it is. Bring parts from 034 and we'll probably empty out my catch can after that. Or I would do that. I'm gonna watch YouTube. A little bit, charge my phone, then do that, then go to the gym, then shower, and then uh, Kaylin's gonna come over. We're gonna go to the whatchamacallit, the fair, and all that later. So, yeah, it's gonna be a good day. Whew, it's had a really good chest day. I'm hurting. I've been at the gym for like an hour and 15 minutes. I'm listening to this really good Joe Rogan podcast. Some Tom by you, something. I'm probably messing that name all up, but. That this really intense conversation about the way AI is going and how crazy it's going to be within the next not so far future. Shit's mind blowing. That's what I'm saying. You guys need to listen to Joe Rogan. It's going to get you thinking about things you never even thought to think of. It's it's crazy. Get on that shit. Uh, the ch channel is power. The powerful JRE, or just type in Joe Rogan. You'll see the JRE channel. Just start clicking on shit. Start out with people that you know. There's, there's Steve-O. There's, there's all types of people. Just figure that shit out. All right, guys. What's up? Sorry if there's a little extra noise. I got you on the tripod. Back to shirtless Bryce. Natural habitat in the garage. It's nice and hot. I'm sweating from the gym. But here, we're, what we're going to do, we're going to... There's a bolt on the bottom of this that allows it to drain. You got one right here. And then one down there on the motor mount, we unloose, take those, and we'll pull this over and drain it. I'll grab a cup or something, and then we're gonna jack up the car real quick, get under there and see which um, revision that we have, because there's two different types of dog bone inserts depending on, on which one you have, obviously. All right, we'll start out here. It's a 16 mil. I should probably have it on the, this damn thing with one of them. Ugh. Forget what it's torqued down to, but I'll get I'll get back to that one. Whoops. Kinda sucks that you gotta use the motor mount bolt. It's really only supposed to be one time use. This will be my second. So I'm gonna order a bolt along with uh, spark plugs for on when I go back to Pennsylvania so I have extra just in case. This will be a four millimeter. Kind of tight. I should be using a socket, but. Oh. Say hi. Sa. Sa. So, got a nice empty water bottle here. Um, Are you the injectors? No, I'm gonna empty out the catch can. Oh, okay. So, we're gonna see all the nasty shit. It's gonna probably look like coffee and dick. We'll see. I'll give you 25 seconds. Well, actually, we're gonna, I mean, you're not even going to hold the camera. I'm going to have you hold the catch can while I undo it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, 
Well, I can't. How am I supposed to undo it and catch all the flow at the same time? You got two hands. That's all I got is two hands. <laughs> <laughs> all right, where do you want to put the tripod at? Uh, we'll set it up over here. And, uh, actually, I literally have the tripod set up on top of a rotary motor. So if this isn't the most elaborate stand ever, then I don't know what it is. But so drain. Here, you want to Grab. Oh, geez, I'm not sure what size it is. I'm gonna go The drain's here. Well, don't, don't tell the two. We don't want to get yeah, it up yeah. there. So. It's probably like a. It looks like a ten. Alright, it's a six, so let me grab a rag and we'll be blown up. There's an episode where like Fry gets to go back to uh, the 21st century via like dream like you know consumption. Mm -hmm. And uh here we go. Here we just go reverse, we'll stick the top one in, and I'll look up the torque for the motor mount bolt, and we're good. We got our torque down now. The torque rating is 40 Newton meters plus a quarter turn. 40 Nm converted to foot pounds is 29.5. So go to 29.5, take off your torque wrench, go another quarter turn, you're done. I see you tighten up the little bolt now, and then we'll jack the car up. I need to see what kind of uh, dog bone mount insert that I need. All right, so I can't even really get under the car without, I used to have the wheel ramps, but my friend took them back. So anyway, I can't boom. But I can't really fill in the car without taking the wheel off because we're lowered. So I'm literally just gonna stick the car, the camera under the car and get like a good little video of around that spot, what I need to see. And I'll go over the video, take a screenshot, and I'll compare that to the charge to see what I need to let the guy know which version I need. So we'll make life easy. And uh, you guys can see the undercarriage. It's a little dirty, a little greasy, a little oily. I don't know how many times I spill oil back there, but we're good. Ooh. That was pretty nerve wracking having this. The cameras or the, the screen of my phone so low to the ground when I'm trying to, to look at the damn thing, but we got it. We're good. We'll jack the car back up, take the jack or the, the jack stand out, and we're done. She should be here any minute, so she used to see me all nice, sweaty, dirty. I'm not sure how shit and told her that that's what my car peeps up. <laughs> Let's see what she says. This is why we use jack stands, because this jack sucks, and it, it let itself back down. I did not let the pressure out at all. I'm really into getting the jacks. But I'm scared to go to freaking, what's it called? Harbor Fright. That's like a freaking heaven for car guys. And I want to go in there and like blow a bunch of money. So I've been avoiding going to get a jack. Like, oh yeah, I'll need this someday. Uh, <laughs> I'm 
come down here sweating dicks. You can see how bad my tires were rolling onto the sidewall at autocross. All these little marks you see going up and down, that's how much tire my tire was rolling over while I was on the track, which is pretty crazy. God, I'm sweating, it's hot. It's not even really that hot, it's just humid, and it's normally not humid here, so you don't really sweat. But, that's sweat. Like, a lot less than once in a Nasty. Anyway, she should be here any minute. As soon as she gets here, I'm popping in the shower, and then we're gonna go eat and head to the fair. And I knew it was a good idea to wait to go to the fair until the sun was going down, because it, I don't want to go there and sweat balls either. Salt from the catch can. It wasn't as much as I thought. I kind of shook it up and you could see where the, the fuel was separating from the oil. So. I'll let that settle. I'll get another picture of it later. And I got these, these Unesco all wheel drive stickers to throw on at some point, but I need to get ready. Almost to the fair, and now we're waiting on a fucking train. And it's going forever, and ever, and ever. Hell along. This place like, should I use to listen to, like, back in, like... That's the only fucking swings. They kind of scare me, but... The last ride, we did the drop. I've had a heart attack. I'm not really scared of rides, but as I'm getting older, my nerves are bad. Had a lot of fun last night at the fair. It was a good time. Obviously, I haven't been there in like a year, so. That was fun. It was dollar ride night, so we got to ride a bunch of rides. There's a couple we didn't get to ride because she was wearing sandals and they wouldn't let her get on with open toed, -toed shoes, but we still had fun regardless. Went around and I went up seeing the pigs and the bunnies and the chickens and the goats and the donkeys and the cows and the bulls. It's been a while since I've seen really any farm animals. It's been quite some time actually. You know, I grew up all around the farm and you know, again all around the farm, but I wasn't much of a farm kid growing up either, really. I went to a farm a couple times on field trips randomly, but yeah. Anyway, um, Jake's about to be here soon. And we're gonna do a review of this Hellcat. I can't wait, I'm excited. I'm gonna put up this video for tomorrow, being Friday, today's Thursday. Jake's video is gonna be Monday now. I was gonna make it for the day, but we were gonna record yesterday, but I don't wanna rush it. I really wanna get like a good freaking edit with good music and all that. So stay tuned for Monday where we'll have a Hellcat review. Um, I'll be back on here later to tell you guys how, how it went, give you some hype, probably throw some stickers on, and we'll call it a night. So I'll see you guys here in a couple hours. Go for it. really good on camera too. Yeah. See ya. Well that whole experience is, experience, is, experience was awesome. I'm extremely tired. I meant to nap before this car review but I didn't have enough time and I had to do shit on my phone, on the computer and eat. Anyway. Baller ass day, baller ass car, baller ass color, baller ass person. Jake's the man. That was a lot of fun. Ugh. I really wanted to get up on the roof and get a time lapse, but Maddie's not home and I don't want to move his truck and climb all up on it to get on the roof. We'll see, I'm gonna get in here and transfer all this video footage and start editing up a bit. Um, yeah, stay tuned Monday for. Uh, for this car review. I, I, I'm going to put a lot of work into it. I'm not doing all that much this weekend, but uh, I might go to the track tomorrow, but still. Either way, 
Like if you like, subscribe, and I'll catch you on the flip-flop.